and place it on the sidewalk in the middle of the stage. <laughs> That's very nice, happy looking golden Lego pack over there. Nice plug. <laughs> Countdown to launch. Four, three, two, one. Coming up. Become trainers with their companies or contact the Penang Science Council for any assistance required. Fields of science, technology, and engineering through the practitioners themselves Motorola, Intel, NI, DAM, AMD, DCM, Detrox, Osram, Seagate, Nation Gate, B Brown, SRM, Sisbadi, and KDU are all your guide, your trainers and will guide you and allow you the unique experience, the work experience of how is it like to work as a team under a professional engineer. And I'm sure you will find this a unique opportunity on how to identify problems and devise solutions as part of a team. And this is what we want to achieve for Penang. The Penang Science Council was only mooted a year ago. I think we have come a long way. We have five different pillars and today we are seeing only one of the five. And I think it is the Penang Science Council that gives us the confidence of investors in Penang. Because the most important resource that Penang has that attracts investors all over the world is our human talent. And what investors, foreign, local alike want to see is a strong commitment towards building, developing and harnessing human talent. And the Penang Science Council is one of the key initiatives, one of the key plans in the efforts by the state government to tell the whole world that we are serious about human talent here, that we are proud of our human talent here, and we want to build and retain our human talent here. And we believe that the Penang Science Council can establish Penang as a center of science and a center of excellence for science and technology. The motto of the PSC is very simple. Just two words, inspiring innovation. But if we can succeed in inspiring innovation, in making innovation as part of our culture, our success is assured. Confidence that you can be the best, that you can attain excellence. Number two, number two, I think how we see ourselves and how we see our friends and how we see each other is very important. Remember this, it is not who you are that is important. It is what you are that is important. It doesn't matter if you are poor. It doesn't matter where you came from. It is what you do with yourself, what you are, that will determine your future that would be valued by society. So remember, my friends, bukan siapa anda yang penting. Apa yang anda bina untuk diri sendiri yang paling penting sekali. The energy, the expertise and the entrepreneurship of Penang, I'm sure, must be maintained so that we can retain our good friends to continue to expand as well as attract new friends, new companies to come to Penang. So the Penang Science Council is something that we have waited a very long time. Even though it was started last year, but I think the idea of having a Penang Science Council was, some, was 
something that everyone wished for, but did not happen. And finally today, from our friends in the corporate sector, we see it happening. And we believe that it will succeed because the operating mechanism is unique based on three key operating mechanisms. Number one, full participation from the academia and the industry. Number two, purely industry driven. We want those who can do the job to drive it. And thirdly, of course, minimal government interference, only facilitation from the state government. And we believe that the Penang Science Council will be the leading science council in the country to push science and technology to let everyone know that science and technology will not only be your ticket to the future but also allow Penang to grow and prosper. <coughs> Once again, thank you and good luck in the coming years ahead with the Penang Robotics Competition. Let us breed not just entrepreneurs but also innovators. So I see here today our future entrepreneurs, our future innovators. Let us show that we can be the best in the country.